Hello, I'm Charles Moffat, and it's unboxing time again, or unbagging in this case. And I'm enjoying a nice drink, and my son is playing in the backyard with his t toys and some markers. Let's, you know, hope he doesn't uh, start drawing on the white house with his markers. Well, at least they're, you know, they're washable markers that, you know, dissolve in water, so it will rain, and then they'll just, you know, clean off easily. Whatever. <laughs> anyway, let's get started. So, what do we have here? Well, this is the first book from my Wolfric the Wanderer series. There you go. And the Wolfric for Wanderer this series is ostensibly my version of Conan the Barbarian. It's, you know, similar to that in many respects, although there's a lot more archery in my version. Uh, and there's also dragons and elves and all the stuff that you expect from Tolkien. So it's kind of like a cross between Robert E. Howard's work and Tolkien's work. And then next on the list we have The Adventures of Rathgar, The Sunken Castle. Okay. So neither of these two are, are new. These are some older ones. Basically what happens is every time somebody buys a book from me in person, then I order new ones. Uh, this one is a novelette that takes place between books one and two, so novels one and two of the Rathgar series. And it's basically just a nice bit of short fiction that takes place between those two novels. And this is the new one. Came out a couple months ago. Uh, this has been sitting on my shelf for a while. I just haven't bothered to open it. Hi, Richard. Sneaky. Hey, so this is another Wolfric the Wanderer book, uh, The Raven's Feast. Uh, and you can tell that the raven there is actually eating a corpse on the roof of that building. Yeah, while other ravens circle in the background. Yes, uh, that's a dire picture in that uh, particular book. But this is the relatively new one that came out, I think, back in January. I just haven't uh, got around to making a video until now. So, following a hunch, Wolfric the Wanderer has arrived in the port city of Kostmark, which is currently plagued by the Zarsian Pox. After determining his hunch was false, he is determined to leave, but his plans go awry when a fire-scarred wizard, a undead highwayman, and a cursed cutlass decide to get in his way. Yeah, and it's a sword and sorcery short story. So, yeah, I, I enjoyed writing this particular one. Uh, has has a, a darker theme than some of my other uh, Wolfric the Wanderer stories. Uh, definitely more gruesome. But for those people who like the darker, gruesome stuff, yeah, this is for you. And you get to, to enjoy it. And then, there, of course, inside there's the artwork. This is exclusive to this book. Yeah. The Ravens. I enjoyed this quite a bit. Okay, I gotta go. I got a toddler who just uh, apparently wants to climb over a fence. Bye-bye.